Wow! What's up, money geeks? Mr. V here. Welcome to another video, guys. In this video, I want us to talk about ticket symbol CCIV Lucid Models. Again, guys, I've covered this stock here on the channel before they were planning on making the announcement. Talked about it when the announcement was kind of like in the limbo, and then finally now they have actually completed the merger. Um, they actually announced yesterday that Lucy and Churchill Capital are merging, so it's official. So that's what I wanted to talk about today, and then talk about some price projection, and then look at the future of the stock. But before we get started, guys, if you're new to the channel, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. So if that's something that interests you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and your notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. Lucy Models um, and Churchy Capital are finally, um, you know, they finally completed the deal. And this is something that we have all been anticipating, hoping that it would happen. So again, when I did a video, I think last week, um, over the weekend or so, I mentioned to you guys that you know, there was rumor that these guys were gonna announce on Tuesday, February 23rd, uh, their deal. But apparently they didn't want to wait until Tuesday. They did it uh, Monday, uh, February 22nd, after hours and it, the stock just took a massive beating. Again, this is something that I didn't even see coming. I thought there would be some excitement on Wall Street with the stock, but after the announcement, as you can see here on the chart here, guys, this is just a one week chart. So the stock went from a high of about 60 something dollars here. So we look at here about 64, almost $65. And then when they made the announcement, the stock actually pulled back. If you can see here, and then just like look at that drop drop and just like crazy so again i don't know what happened there um there was no excitement on wall street about the merger so i think that the terms of the merger were not super exciting to wall street but again it doesn't mean that the company is not a great company so uh, again to me this was an opportunity for people that uh didn't have to start to jump in and and really buy the stock but before we actually go and take a look uh, or talk about projections guys i want to bring us some important information here to you guys so um this is the ceo of our Lucid Motors on CNBC um, talking about the fact that even after the merger, they are delaying production of their Lucid Air because they were supposed to start production this spring, but I think they're delaying that and they're moving it to the second half of 2021. So again, that's just something that I, I didn't see coming, uh, the fact that they're delaying production. He didn't really break down why they were, you know, moving production uh, or delaying production. But again, um, that's maybe some of the reasons why they were hesitant to announce their merger. In my opinion, that's what I think. So again, if we can go back here, um, you know, the CEO was there talking about the fact that they're, they're making that delays. So uh, one of the things that I wanted to uh, bring up to you guys here is uh, the CEO actually mentioned some, some stuff that I think is critical for us uh, as investors. So comparing Lucid Models to Tesla, again, Tesla has established themselves. They've been able to go through production. Um, I mean, you know all the good stuff about Tesla, but he mentioned four key things. Number one is that they have a uh, better technology than Tesla. So Lucid has a better technology than Tesla. The way you can even confirm is because the current CEO of Lucid actually came from Tesla. So he probably understand what they have over there as technology and the improvements that uh, Lucid has actually made. The second claim he made was that their cars are faster than Tesla. So we're talking about the Model Y, uh, the Model S, and anything that Tesla has, they claim that their current Lucid Air is faster than and Tesla and then the third claim he made was that their charging is faster so when you plug your car to charge it it charges relatively faster compared to Tesla and then overall he says they're cheaper if you look at the overall package what they are giving and what Tesla would give um, again they are way cheaper than Tesla so those are four claims that he made but again in my opinion guys the way I see this particular company I don't see it as just another electric uh, vehicle company I see them as a competitor to, to Tesla and even more so beyond that so if you guys are people that understand or know your cars uh, if you take for instance Toyota Toyota has 
their average brand, which is just a Toyota brand that you see like the Camrys and all that stuff. And then they have the Lexus brand, which is their luxury side of Toyota, right? So you get the Lexus, which is the luxury side of Toyota that represent, in my opinion, Lucid Air and Tesla. So Tesla would be just the regular Toyota and then Lucid Air would be the Lexus, which is the luxury brand for Toyota. So that's the way I see it. That's the way I value this company and that's how much faith I have in this company. So where do we go from here now that we've seen all this? So the next step that I want you to take a look at right now is the price because if this thing went to about a high of almost $65 and then pulled down to $30, it came down to, yeah, it's about $30. This is to me, this is the best gift that this stock gave us. So again, at $30, this thing is going to be at least a $200 or $300 stock in the next three to five years. That is easy. So I personally, I'm heavy on the stock. Um, you guys know I do have Tesla. I have a good position, a good size position in Tesla. And I think that Lucid is right behind them. And Lucid is not even claiming that they're selling their cars. They're claiming that they have a better technology. Um, right now, they're claiming that their batteries um, made by Lucid's um, technology division, um, Ativa, is currently being used in Formula E. Um, racing which is kind of crazy so I mean that is how fast they if they're using it in racing I think uh, that the company is claiming that their technology um, does help so this is something that I just want you guys to keep an eye on and then once as once this merger is completed the ticket symbol is going to change from CCIV to LCID that's going to be the new ticket symbol LCID so Guys, this is again to me. This stock is um, right now a steal. This because this company has the potential to go as high as three, four hundred dollars in my personal opinion, uh, because of the quality of the work that they have. Because as of right now, if you look at all the other sparks that have come out, a lot of them had some questions, um, business model, product, and and with uh, Lucid, we haven't seen any of those. They took the time did everything before going public. They already have the manufacturing facility, even though they delay manufacturing, but at least they have that uh, in Arizona ready to go. And then, I mean, like so far, the team that they have has done a good job in making sure that they cross um, all their T's and dot their I's uh, before going uh, public. So in conclusion, guys, I think um, Lucid is a great company to invest in long term um, this one you might see if the market were to bounce back as we can see here uh, right now sitting at about 35 if the market were to bounce back you think it is a climb up to 50 60 70 dollars but this would be for a queen sweet for a quick swing, swing trade but if you're looking to go long term buy this one and just throw the key somewhere don't even look at the stock for the next three to five years come back and take a look that's where you want to be in three to five years um again this is not your typical stock which you just buy expect growth allow it time to actually grow because this company has huge potential and they're talking about start building suvs by 2023 and so to me those are those are uh, plans that uh, eventually will get the company um, out there and more and more people are going to start tr trying to get it again this is luxury because if you think about tesla a lot of people love tesla and it's a luxury brand but now you bring lucy that takes that uh, luxury another level up um hollywood and all these guys um they're going to want to drive the car it's electric and it looks beautiful and it's you know relatively cheap compared to other vehicles so that's something that you want to keep in mind so let me know again in the comment section guys what do you think about this um again i just for transparency guys i am heavy on lucid and tesla um i see them as as far as electric vehicles as the guys that are going to dominate the space um the big boys like ford and gm are late to the party ford is pushing hard gm is pushing hard they had the opportunity to step in and take over the space because they really had the infrastructure and the delay so i think um lucid has a huge uh, potential here again let me know in the comment section what do you what do you think about this 
if you're new to the channel guys we talk about how to earn money how to save money how to invest and build wealth so if that's something that interests you go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content also if you're looking to get started with investing Weibo is still doing their promotion where if you sign up and deposit a hundred dollars you get some free stocks links in the description below and as always guys do your due diligence don't be a crazy savage and stay motivated